Hello, in this video, I'll show you how to edit globe and map elements more efficiently. First, decide if you'll use the animated element for one target or two. After dragging it onto the timeline, place the playhead where the animation first slows down, which is target A. Now, to navigate the screen controls, make L shaped movements. For example, up and down, then left to right. This greatly aids in navigation. Once you've found your target, adjust the zoom level. Now reposition the playhead to where the animation slows down again, which will be your second target. Alright, now choose your target again using the screen controls. If the globe is tilted, you can fix it with the inspector controls. See the result. It's important to note that the target A setup affects target B, so set them sequentially, first A, then B. Notice anything? Now I'll need to readjust the second target due to changes in the first. If the globe is tilted as shown here, Reset these parameters to their initial values, this will realign the screen controls. Then you can readjust as needed. Remember to disable the guides before exporting. Another tip for smoother screen control movement is to decrease the zoom scale before determining your point of interest. You can also disable continuous rotation of the globe and clouds in these parameters. Lastly, for even more precise adjustments, you can directly input values into the inspector, if necessary, use decimal points. I hope this video was helpful to you. Thanks for watching.